How's it going everybody? It's Timbo Flex here. Time for another YouTube video of Hogwarts Legacy title. It's time for Harry to Perry. Uh, so, whoa. <laughs> I don't think I've stayed on the loading screen long enough to see that before. That's cool. Uh, last time, I believe, so a little, little mishap happened. And, uh, oh, nice. Oh, sweet. So, uh, I messed up last time, and I gotta remember how to play. Fuck. There we go. Alright, so I messed up and, like, teleported out of here. And, uh... It was not good. Oh, fuck. Alright. Oh. Did they just come back? What the fuck? Nice. Oh, very nice. Okay, okay. Got a little safe ground right here. That was a little fast thinking. Alright, now what am I going to do? Uh, can I snipe? Let's see if I can snipe. Yeah, let's see. Oh, good. Oh, shit. Got him. Okay, let's see what's going on. All right. So I, I panic and figured out how to cheese them. Nice. Whew. Anyways, so I just like I I started the game right in this hellhole, and uh, I thought I was gonna be back at Hogwarts. So last video, I came here, and then I pressed start, and then I accidentally I looked at the map and I accidentally teleported to a flu powder, and I teleported right out of my progress right here, and it took a long time to get here. I am very glad that the save brought me back to right here. All right. It is a book after all. What are we doing here? Uh, so we went into the, um, the the Forbidden Library, and uh, we're trying to find some information. Ooh, did that book just take a piss? <laughs> what? There we go. Yeah, sorry about the, that, Mark. Uh, I was a little distracted. <laughs> that was uh, kind of intense.
Is that Dumbledore just like making it rain? It is. Hello, sir. I look like a pound face. Your wizard, Harry. <laughs> He's like, don't look at me, you poor scum. You wanted to see me? The headmistress Fitzgerald, Professor Rackham. Miss Isadora. Morgan. Oh, it's not Dumbledore. Welcome. Professor Rookwood, Professor Bacar. We understand that you are adjusting well to life at Hogwarts. I am. I am glad. Especially in light of your unusual situation, starting as a fifth year. As it happens, I was also admitted to Hogwarts as a fifth year. I've never heard of another like us. Miss Morgan, when we spoke yesterday after class, you asked... Sorry about that, Mark. <laughs> the beautiful swirls you saw years ago when we visited your hand. I recognized you all immediately. I cannot thank you enough for what you did. We were glad to help. And yes, I did see swirls of magic everywhere that day. My father insists it was my imagination running wild, but it was certainly real to me. It was not I love how this game is just like a movie. Of all, Professor Rackham can see them too, but we have never known of another who could. I don't understand. What are they? The whispers or traces that appear when a particular form of ancient magic is wielded. Ancient magic? Few are capable of wielding it. Hogwarts itself is a stronghold of ancient magic. So if I can see traces of ancient magic, does that mean I can wield it too? With the proper training. But let us not get ahead of ourselves, Miss Morgana. Before I can train you to wield such magic, you must first master all that Hogwarts has to offer. Hmm. A magic this powerful can do great harm in the wrong hands. It must be wielded by a select few. Mark, are you able to see those now? We ask that you not speak to anyone about what we have discussed here today. Oh, that's an evil face. She just made a very evil face. That's the new Mrs. Voldemort. Sebastian. Sneaking in the restricted section again! I had thought we were through with this mischief. Clearly, detentions are insufficient. I'm afraid I must take this to the headmaster. But that being said, Peeves informs me that you didn't come alone tonight. If someone has coerced you, I would have you tell me. You're a bright boy. Don't waste this. There was nobody else. I came alone. That's right, Sebastian. That's that is oh, my Sebastian. buddy right there. What Loyal. Your uncle say? You know what? You spend time in, in the in the clink, and I'll, I'll make sure that everything's taken care of. Your family, all that. All right. Wait, am I supposed to sneak out of here? Cause <laughs> is it still nighttime? Cause I'm not supposed to be here during nighttime. How the hell do I get out of here? Oh, there's a door. <laughs> Everything's brown out here.
Got it. I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, I don't see students walking around, so. I don't know if I'm supposed to be running out in the open. Okay. So it looks like it's like uh, dawn right now. <laughs> Those little uh, suits of armor scare the fuck out of me sometimes. <laughs> they just randomly like move a leg on my like, crack. Oh yeah, I could have flu powdered over here. Yeah, I think we're alright. Alright. What do we have here? Tomes and tribulations. What up, y'all? You cannot be serious. Goblins working with rookwood makes no sense. It is rather unorthodox, to say the least. Unorthodox? It's inconceivable. It's... Ah, Fig. You have a visitor. I'll see what I can find out. Hmm. Sir, <laughs> I think you to search the restricted section while you were with Professor Black. It was a book we were after. Oh, so I'm... Okay, I'm supposed to come up and talk to him. the restricted section but how thinking on it perhaps it's best you spare me the details fair enough in fact the book was below the restricted section as it appeared on the map i want to hear everything first let's have a look Pages seem to be missing. It appears someone has got to the book before us. Still, I will need time to study what remains. Perhaps we can still salvage something useful, though it may take some time. I wonder why it was here, below Hogwarts. I think I know, sir. I saw two more memories where I found the book. Another pensive. Godric's heart. The man we saw before, Percival Rackham, was a professor here. The first memory showed him God, and three other game. professors using ancient magic to restore a hamlet from a drought. Miriam was right. And the second memory? They were talking to a student who started as a fifth year, like I did. She could see traces of magic too. Why those memories? Hmm. Perhaps this book will explain. Now I'll have to take it with me to London. The headmaster has insisted that I speak directly to the minister about George's death. What will you tell them about Mr. Osric's death? I don't know how much I dare say. George tried to convince the ministry about Ranrock, but to no avail. My instinct is to follow the path we are on for the moment and keep the details to ourselves. Until we I trust Big. I think he's cool, dude. I understand. I'll see what I can learn about the missing pages while you're gone. Good. I still don't, don't think the dude in the beginning studies. actually died. Your work is improving by the day, but you'll want to pay attention in herbology and potions. There's more to magic than spellcasting. Oh, I am down to learn some potions. Occupied while you're gone. You've done exceptionally well. I look forward to seeing all that you've accomplished when I return. Oh, and don't neglect your friends. You may be surprised by how much you can learn from them as well. Okay. So, we got that completed. Alright. Let's check the old Mappy Poo and the quests. 
a dendrobiology class, okay? Biology class, cache in the castle. The first shows that were not so skeleton on display. I know. Nah, we're gonna we're gonna stick to the story for now. Spell combinations practice two. Ooh, cross wands round three. All right, we'll go to her biology her biology class. We'll do a little bit of practice and then we'll do cross wands. Professor Assignment Track Quest. Meet me in Lower Hogsfield as soon as possible. I would like to talk to you about Rookwood and Harlow, and it might be best to do so outside of the castle. Huh. Professor Fig and Weasley have asked that I teach you an additional defensive spell. Please Ooh. complete the assignments I have given you, and then proceed to see me in my classroom. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Now he just sent you an outpost. Where we going? All the way out here. Hold on a sec. Uh, let's see. Must, oh, world map. Whoa. This game just got a whole lot bigger. This is the world map is covered by fog, limiting what you can see. Our small communities throughout the world. Hamlets are small communities around the world. This is a hamlet, Lower Hogsfield, Hamlet. Provide an opportunity for vendors, flea flames, sacrifice uh, and collectibles. Okay. As you explore, you will move fog and more than that, revealing the opportunities, abandoned camps, and many other locations. Okay. Okay. I got a lot to think about. Let me move a little bit closer. My, it's getting lighter, so my eyesight's getting worse. <laughs> First sign of me getting fucking old. Why is my PS4 for so good? Okay. The girl from Uganda. I guess let's go talk to her first. It was Natty. Now. Whoa. Where are we going? So we're going to Hogsmeade? Nope. Going all the way out there. That'll work. Nice. This broken broom belonged to Celine Wetenby. Blah blah blah. Okay. All right. So I'm going outside. Yep. Cool beans. Now where am I going? Oh, I want to receive a howler. I am fucking booking it right now. Rebellion. Now, something about me with games is I love alchemy and <laughs> the whole aspect of potions and herbs and, and all that jazz, you know? Just a good old-fashioned mixology. So if I see any herbs, I'm definitely going to take a little pit stop. 
Right? Just like that. Uh, how was I supposed to do that? There we go. Yeah. Okay. I wonder what happened to me. Let's do a little bit of exploring. Let's see what's up. <laughs> I don't know what these are for, but I'm going to get them. It's just like a little treasure trove. Because I like treasure. That's another thing about me. I love secrets. Secrets in games is literally half the reason why I play games. Oh, it's the owl place. Okay. I don't know what the technical term for an owlery is. Actually, I think that's it. It's an owlery. What is up? Hello, Hedwig. Hello, other Hedwig. Hello, Mr. Hedwig. Mm, Rebellion. Rebellion. Uh, Lydia, there we go. Oh, splendid. Oh. Nope. Give it to me. Where, where's that? Oh, paper. Where'd you go? Oh, I should not fall. Well, I guess I just have to... Ah, there it is. Got it. Noise. Alright, I think it'd be safe to say I got everything Rebellion. up here. How do I get down? Okay. Oh, nice. I, I probably should read those. I, <laughs> I just, uh, I don't want to. You know what I'm saying? I was literally bred in my eyeballs. Okay. Well, that was a nice little field trip. Now I'm back to doing what we were supposed to do. I can't believe I have to run all this way. I'm going to tell you what, the scenery sure is pretty. I'm just going to run through the woods. Because everyone knows the wizard woods is safe. I feel like uh, I'm in Red Dead Redemption right now. What are those? Hmm. 
Okay. I wonder if it's safe out here. Rebellion. Whoa. Ho, 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 ho. Nice. I just found the treasuriest of treasure troves. A ho, ho, ho. This is great. No, 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 no. We are gonna. Whoa. Okay. Rebellion. Cedar Rivet Gloves. Hey, dude, I'm just gonna steal all of your, uh, you know, hard earned belongings, if you don't mind. get inside you level one lock okay well <laughs> all right let's see what I got Well, can't wear them. We got a new one? Ooh. I thought I'd change it to that already. I like that. But I like this better. Yeah, that's good. Alright. What's this? Let's see. 17 defense? Fuck yeah. Hmm. Hell yeah. I actually wouldn't mind that one. Nah. All right. And I got the best hat on. Yep. Need to find me a better hat. And some gloves. Okay, okay. Inventory. All right, I've yet to look around in the inventory. Arthur's map, a treasure map. Arthur probably found while searching office. Okay. I don't give a shit about that. Okay. That's it. That's all I have. Hmm. Seems like I would have more. Ooh. One kind of cloak. All right, well, let's go. Let's go look at that. Oh shit! Why does everything look so weird? There we go. I like that you can you can wear whatever you want and still like apply the stats. It's very convenient. Uh, collection. I don't care about the collections. 
All right, Natty. It is good to see you, my friend. Yo, what's up? Hello, Natty. How are you? I am well, thank you. I was there, and I saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow at the Three Broomsticks. I have been worried about you. I'm all right at the moment. If you don't mind my asking, why were they looking for you? They want something that Professor Fig and I found at Gringotts. When were you at Gringotts? Just before we came to Hogwarts. In fact, it's why I was late to the sorting ceremony. A port key brought us there after the dragon attacked our carriage. What on earth? There's one more thing. It's a bit odd, if I'm honest. Professor Fig says I have a rare connection to a powerful form. Of I'm sorry, magic. but why am I just I... spilling the beans to what this does person? That mean? I'm still learning, but I can see traces of it. And I've cast magic I can't otherwise explain. I know that's a lot to absorb. It is. And I will have more questions. For now, it is safe to say that Rookwood and Harlow are a threat to both of us. To all of us. Which is why I wanted to speak to you. Everyone has been talking about you defending Hogsmeade from that troll attack. And I shall never forget watching Sorona stand up to Rookwood and Harlow in the Three Broomsticks. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. What sort of stand? Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili land. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my new home. Rookwood and Harlow are a dangerous pair on their own. And you should know that Rookwood is in league with Ranlock. I had heard they were seen in Hogsmeade together. All the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations, taking him down with crippled Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true, but shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understandably would not discuss details with a student. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talking about a massive poaching operation that Harlow was planning. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit, Try to get the evidence that Officer Singer needs. All right, but how? I am going to watch and listen and find out precisely what Harlow is up to. I shall reach out when I know more. In the meantime, remember, I am here if you need me. Thank you, Natty. Be on your Okay, your so I've made a friend. I beg your pardon. How oh, dare you threaten me? What? What's Ooh. going on here? What? What the heck? What's going on over there? Revelio. There's another one right there too. Uh, I kind of want to get that quest first, see if it matters. Need you for some assistance. What up? Hello. Can I help you? Oh, thank goodness. Yes. My name is Grace Pinch Smedley. Of the Bath Pinch Smedleys? I was hoping someone would come along soon. I was about to defy my father's wishes and would never have forgiven myself. You see, I need to retrieve something from the bottom of the lake. Might you be the one to help me? An underwater adventure sounds like fun. Diving into the lake doesn't sound like fun. Diving into the lake sounds like an adventure. Tell me more. Splendid. Precisely the response I'd hoped for. What do you need help retrieving? Years ago, my grandfather, who fancied himself quite the astronomer, set sail from Hogsmeade Station for what was meant to be a quick stargazing cruise with my grandmother. They never returned. I'm so sorry. What happened to them? We can't be sure. <laughs> they went to the we gas station to get some cigarettes. Their boat made it back to shore. They were presumed drowned. Father was so distraught that he forbade our family from setting foot on or in the Black Lake ever again. A treasured family astrally vanished with them that night. If you could dive down and retrieve it, I may be able to bring my father some peace. You seem to think I might have heard of the Bath Pinch Smedleys. Why would I know your family? That's like asking why the sky is blue or grass is green. 
The pink smedley name is synonymous with intellectual curiosity. We are known for our contributions to science and art. I'm surprised you haven't heard of us, frankly. But with all I plan to discover about the world around us, those that don't That's a get little pretentious. Name certainly one day will. What exactly is an astrolabe? It's an astonishing ancient navigational tool. Essentially, a handheld model of the universe. It's mainly Ooh. used for studying the stars, astronomical pursuits, but it has nearly a thousand uses. Fascinating device. Sadly, I'd imagine it's rusted beyond repair now. Still, we'd love to have it returned to us. It would be like getting a bit of my grandparents back. Like a finger or, or you know, a toe? Hmm. It sounds dangerous, especially for something of mere sentimental value. I understand. But I'd be forever grateful. Of course, you may discover much more than the asteroid. How grateful. <laughs> Anything else you found would be all yours. I've cross-referenced the vessel's last alleged location against the lake's topography, depth charts, and tide schedule. My best guess is that it's just over there, about a furlong from the dock. Hmm. It would be wonderful to have my grandfather's astrolabe. A furlong? <laughs> what the heck is a furlong? I do hope you find the astrolabe. It would mean so much to our family. It sounds as if her astrolabe is just northeast of the dock. Just north. East of the dog. How do I dive? Can I breathe? <laughs> Am I supposed to know a spell that breathes underwater or, or what? This must be where the pinch smedley family astrolabe is. Oh. Brown leather fingerless gloves. Uh, okay. Water like this gives me the heebie jeebies. Blackwater plaid, like, plaid, plaid, long coat. So I'm just getting treasure right now. Silver forest spectacles. <laughs> All right. So I was out here in my day clothes, just in it, in the murky water. I would, I would never do this in real life. Prince Medley's family heirloom, Wigan Wheeled Potion. I should Anything else? Now that I found her family astrolabe. Nah, I'm gonna keep it. Is there any way to go faster? Ah, oh, come on. Now I'm all wet. Is there no climbing feature? No upper body strength? Wizards. Hello, Grace. I followed your bearings on a dive in the Black Lake. Oh, how incredible. Did you find the astrolabe? <laughs> yeah, a furlong uh, was uh, the exact measurement I needed. Thank you. I did, and I'm keeping it. Hold on. Should I keep the astrolabe? Choosing to keep the astrolabe or demanding a reward will certainly annoy Grace, but players will ultimately end up with exactly the same rewards regardless of if they choose. They'll get 180 XP and the mermaid mask, a cosmetic item that can be used to customize the appearance of a piece of gear. I'll dive into what I have, looks like a scene. 
I see it in my head. It's a white circle in prison. You know, the camera is on the Well, anyways, I'll give it to him. I did. I hope it makes your father happy. It will. I can't wait to see his face. Thank you so much for doing this for me and for my family. You do well to keep an eye out for more spots to dive. A diver of your caliber is certain to find all sorts of things down there. Thank you again, and I do hope you keep diving. You certainly have a knack for finding treasure. <laughs> the mermaid mask looks so stupid. Oh wow, nice. All right. Well, let's see what's up. Noise. Oh, bitchin. <laughs> hmm. Oh, wow. Nah, I'm good. <laughs> That's a big uh, 1054. Whoa. Nice. My offense just went up a lot. Hell yeah. I don't want those measly rags. Those measly Weasleys? Is that something out there? Yeah. Uh oh. Get the fuck out of here. You. Talking to you. There we go. Uh oh. Well, I'm doing pretty good teasing it right now. Oh, I can't get it. Ooh, nice.
I'll get a shirt uniform. Oh, aren't I supposed to go like back every time it's like night out? I forgot there's like a day sequence. I'm supposed to be they doing must have something. come this way. Think. Child of Merlin. Did you think I might have seen? I've been busy with my research. I do not have time to. Victor Rookwood don't give a doxy's nip back your time. Oi, speak of the devil. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. A student, you can't be sick. <laughs> Enough out of you. Leave her alone. Stay with her. Uh oh. There we go. Oh, what's the light go out of your eyes? Whoa. Collection set of your kill guide has been updated with a new enemy type. You may learn valuable insights on enemies, such as their weaknesses to certain spells. Okay, so the collection says your field guide has. Alright. I'm on the clicker of the Rockwood agents. Uh, these witches will surprise their opportunities with back to back attacks. Their powerful reductor curse can not be blocked by shield charms, but powerful reductor can play. Interrupting that cast with a severing charm will spin them to the point of losing control and hitting one of their own gang. Okay. Whoa. I'm just warming up. What on earth just happened? I've never been accosted in such a manner. You're so close to Hogwarts. I want to see, cause I, I I just I made that bitch go flying. I'm running for my life. <laughs> no, okay, I, I want to see if I had any loot on her. I don't think they drop loot. Are you all right? I am, thanks in no small part to your excellent defensive skills. Care to tell me why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? Ashwinders? Victor Rookwood's thieves and extortionists, his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. It's a long story, but thank you for your help. Mm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Mm. Best get moving on my research before they return. You mentioned someone named Priya. Yes, my wife. She's the one who piqued my interest in Merlin. Gave me a book when we were students at Hogwarts. Typical hard-working Hufflepuff. Brilliant potioner. Has her own shop in Nocturne Alley. She's a traveling vendor. Here's what's going on in the Highlands before I do. You're a researcher. Nora Treadwell at your service. Historian and archaeologist specializing in Merlin's work and life. I thought that Merlin and the tales about King Arthur's court were a myth. Mere myth? <laughs> You're lucky Sir Cadogan didn't hear you. Chatters on endlessly about his connection to Merlin from his portrait at Hogwarts. 
Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know, and I'm studying some curious fixtures he left here centuries ago. Fixtures? These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them all around the area. I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. Ooh. I believe he created them as a diversion for his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> he was terribly fond of puzzles and enigmas. Denigmas. I'm not sure old vine covered pillars are worth studying. <laughs> well, I think anything <laughs> concerning Merlin is worth pursuing, and I shall have you know. No one has yet managed to figure out how they work. But I believe I have just unlocked a crucial clue. I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important component in getting Mallow the trials Sweet. to work. Mallow Sweet. Versatile herb. Merlin repeatedly mentioned it in his writings. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. You see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has its symbol in the center. That started me thinking, what if... The Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the center of the symbols. Precisely. Would you care to do the honors? We can see what comes of our little hmm. hypothesis. I'm down. I brought a trunk chock full of mallow sweet with me. It's just over there by my tent. Tent, 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 tent. Ah, tent. Okay. Well. This trunk. Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. Oh, I have some mallow sweet. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here, as what? well as a stone swell on the ground. Each okay. trunk has these features. Place the mallow suite on the swirl, and we'll see what happens. Where's the swirl? Okay. Did you see that? The vines disappeared. What should I do now? Hmm, this is uncharted territory. I am curious about these piles. Hmm. What should we do now? What if I... Nope. Incendiary. Hey! The flames make the pyre sink. Okay. What about that one? Oh. Okay, so I gotta get him in the right order. Take it we can call that a success? We can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my notes. I may have missed something. Are all of the trials like this one? Hmm? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swell on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe I have what I need to continue my research. My guess is that each hmm. will also require mallow suit, which you can find in Hogsmeade, should you need more. I really must be off. Such a pleasure to meet you. Okay. And do be careful out here. Now, I've got what I needed. I shall return to the safety of my notes. I probably should be back in my dorm.